What up, gang? Just came back from the gym. I'm about to cook some breakfast and shit real fast. But I gotta fucking use this pot. And hey, it's this thing. So the luxury of living by yourself and like don't have to live with your parents and shit like that. I, I cooked some food last night, right? And my mother used to hate this shit. When I lived in the crib with her, she used to hate when I put like food in the, um, like say I cook something or she'll cook something. I just put the whole pot in the refrigerator because I don't be feeling like putting it in something. So the luxury is you get to do shit like that that you low key, if you was living there with your peoples or something like that, you can't do it. I always, I understood it because now I want to make breakfast and now I got to fucking still do this anyway. Like I still got to put this shit in a container and wash the pan out anyway. So I kind of see why it, you know what I'm saying? Like as you get older, you start to realize certain things that you was like, mom, why would I do this, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, so. I'm about to have to take this shit out and put it into this so I can wash this out and use it for my breakfast food. I need to get more pots and shit like that at the same time too because I want to be able to cook like different shit at the same time. I've been on my healthy shit lately, y'all. Um, I made this bet with my homie Reek where it was like, not really a bet. It's kind of like, well, it was a bet, but it's to kind of like help us. So I was like, all right, I'm going to go to the gym at least an hour a day and he got to like go to the library, go somewhere for an hour a day and like, um, write out creative shit or just do something productive so it kind of like keep us on our shit and keep us on our game so i've been going to the gym we started this monday um yeah so i just been going to the gym monday through friday i gotta go to the gym at least an hour a day and shit like that so i've been already needing to go to the gym anyway so yeah and also i've been cooking in the crib i've been on my healthy shit a little bit trying to just not eat out as much as i normally do so you know i say i'm on my I want my become a better person, evolve into a new human being era of my life. So that's what y'all get right now. I might be going to go get a camera today, y'all. I might be going to go get a camera so I can like really take this YouTube shit serious and take it all. Like, I mean, I already took it serious, but like, I feel like I need to just get a camera because I be using my phone, which is cool. It do everything that it needs to do. But I feel like if I get a camera, I'll take it more serious and like do a bunch of different things because this phone that I'm recording on is also my personal phone. So it's like, I don't know, it just feels different, but I don't know, I'm gonna go look at some cameras probably or something like that. And yeah, because I just really wanna make sure I'm giving y'all the best content. Hey y'all, uh, also, I call myself, like I told y'all I'm on my like healthy shit. So I call myself trying to like make something that, so it's, all right, so it's this place called um, Wild Living Foods or some shit like that around the corner. And they got this thing called Strawberry Fields. And it's like this drink where it has strawberries, almonds, cashews, and shit like that. It's like a drink. And it tastes so good. But it's like $10, $11. And I be going to get that shit like all the time. And I'm like, damn, bro, I'm wasting hella money. I probably could just make this myself. So I called myself yesterday going to the grocery store and getting all this shit to make it. And I tried to make it last night. But I kind of tasted it last night when I put the shit in a blender. Like I bought, hold on, let me show you. I bought fucking, I bought the cashews and I bought the almonds, the honey and strawberries and shit like that. Put it in a blender. Oh, shit. And I caught myself trying to make it last night, but when I tasted it, it tasted terrible. And I was like, all right, maybe I'm gonna put it in the refrigerator and tomorrow when I taste it, it's gonna taste better. But I realized that the way they make it is totally different than the way I made it. I put the shit in a blender and all this type of shit. I think they put the strawberries in like a juicer and they get the juice out of the strawberries because it said it was cold pressed and I think cold pressed stuff is the juice. They like juice the fruit and juice shit. I didn't juice the strawberries. So that's probably why this doesn't taste like this. Like I made a fucking almond strawberry smoothie instead of a fucking drink and it tastes terrible. I'm about to taste it again. This is out of the refrigerator, but Last night it was bad, and I'm assuming it's gonna be bad today too, but we're gonna taste it again on camera for y'all. It fucking smells bad too. We're about to taste it though. Ew. Also y'all, um, the shirts have came in. The, uh, from my brand, the shirts have came in. I got these from the factory yesterday. So I'm about to be folding these joints up and sending them out to y'all. Um, the white ones, I also got the black ones right here. Uh, so you got the black ones over here too. So I'm about to be folding this stuff up, packaging it up so I can ship this stuff out to y'all. Yeah, I'm about to be 
folding up that stuff, shipping that stuff out. Um, I'm waiting for the oven to preheat right now because I'm about to put some potatoes in the oven. Um, but yeah, let me go ahead and start packaging this stuff up while I wait for that stuff to cook. Ugh. All right, y'all. So you see, I took my hoodie and shit off, but breakfast is served. Hold on, I want y'all to see. Breakfast is served. I got some bread, toast with some jelly on it, some egg, turkey bacon, and some potatoes. I'm about to eat this crush. I'm watching a YouTube video right now. Uh, Casey Neistat interview. So I'm saying, with some good breakfast. I low-key like breakfast better than any other time of the day. So yeah, I was excited to do this. This is the this is the one thing I do like about grocery shopping. It's like, damn, I get to make my own breakfast and just sit and cool and chill. So yeah, anybody out there that don't be buying groceries and all this other shit, man, go buy some groceries, make you some breakfast, man. Make you some dinner, make you some lunch. It's very like pleasing, for real, for real. Okay, y'all, so I had to stop, um, I had to stop, uh, folding some of the shirts and packing some of the shirts because I forgot that I had to take some of these deep hop orders. Um, so I had like some leftover hoodies and leftover a couple things that I had put up on my Depop. So I'm taking these things to the um, post office right now. Uh, I think the gray hoodies, cause I don't know if you guys know, but I redropped the um, I'm Happy Promise uh, like spray paint hoodies. So those we delivered today. So I'm doing all of that right now. So yeah, those get delivered today and I can start spray painting those and getting those out as well. But this is the stuff that I already have ready. So I need to take this stuff to the post office before people start thinking I'm not delivering stuff or they think I'm scamming. Cause you know, as soon as you don't deliver the next day, people think you scamming and all type of stuff. So I want to make sure everybody get their pieces in a timely manner. You know what I'm saying? I am one person. I don't think people understand this. I'm one person. I got like a million other things that I be doing, but that's no excuse. I'm gonna make sure I'm doing everything I need to do to get y'all y'all pieces. But yeah, that's what I'm about to go do right now. And also I purchased a camera. I told y'all I was gonna get a camera. I purchased the camera, so I'm gonna go to Best Buy and go get that. Uh, yeah, so that is what I'm doing right now, man. We about to take this shit to a whole nother level, man. I'm tired of using the phone. I'm not gonna lie. I was using it for a while because it works. You know what I'm saying? You could do a lot of shit with the phone, but I'm trying to like, I'm trying to just, you know what I'm saying, try new things. That's really what I'm on. I'm on my try new things era of my life right now. So that's what we're doing. So I'm going to go pick that up after we drop this stuff off at the post office. Well, y'all, I just found out somebody stole my license plate. I don't know how somebody took my shit. I went to the gym and shit this morning. So I don't know if they took my shit, like, overnight or did they take it while I was in the gym or did they take it while my shit was parked in the garage? I have no idea. I didn't check my license plate when I got in the car, but... I don't know, I'm about to go f fucking handle this shit right now And then I'll go to Best Buy and pick up the camera And go do whatever else I need to do But I need to do this shit real fast Oh yeah, so we in Best Buy right now I'm getting my camera, man We finally got this joint Got the camera Getting this joint See right there About to have a brand new camera, y'all So I won't have to use my phone no more It ain't Alright, do you need a bag? Uh, please Hopefully, just trying to work how I need to work. There you go, you're all set. Thank you. No problem, thank you. All right, y'all, so we got the camera now. At first, he wasn't going to give me that joint because he, he was trying to say something was off. I'm like, bro, I literally just paid for this joint. What my Apple pay and everything? Like, stop playing, bro. Like, the devil going to try to work his wonders, but we're not doing that right now. But we got this joint. I'm going to head to the crib because they was just about to close, too. I'm glad I made it in time. I looked at the time. I was like, damn, am I going to make it in time? But I made it in time, so <sighs> this is my first camera, y'all. Like, I got like a little camcorder, little joint that I have used that I haven't been able to use yet because I don't got a charger for it. But like, this is my first like camera, camera. Like, nah, y'all, nah. I'm, geek I, I'm. It might not seem like it right now, but I'm geeked up right now to actually see this. And no funnies, y'all might think that I'm weird. I don't want y'all to judge me for this. But the person who put me on to this camera to get. It's this girl on YouTube named Kelly Stamps. And, like, y'all yeah, probably like, bro, why are you watching her? But, like, I be watching some of Kelly Stamps' videos. And she, like, be making, like, vlogs and doing a bunch of different shit. But I looked at her YouTube channel today. And she had a video about, like, what camera you should use to vlog and all that other shit. She made, like, a whole video. 
and it was this camera right here. So I was like, you know what, fuck it. I was just on the phone with my man, Poetic. I was like, bro, I need to just get a camera so I could like really do this YouTube shit and all of that. And he was like, yeah, bro, get a camera. And I wasn't even gonna get this one. I was gonna get something way more expensive, but this joint was like four or $500. So it was like $400 less than the one I was gonna look at. All right, y'all, so we back in the house and I'm about to show y'all this camera. I was gonna like have the next clip, like this clip that I'm recording right now. I was gonna have this be footage off of the camera, but I was like, nah, I'm gonna just wait till my next video, like my actual next video to start recording on a new camera. But I wanted to show y'all um the camera before it ends so the name of this camera is called the zv 1f like sony zv 1f vlogging camera um it was like like i said it was, it was like 500 dollars or something like that you probably could find a used one for cheaper i don't know i didn't even take the time to look but i just was trying to get a camera right now while i was thinking about it and i'm about to show y'all this joint right now so this is the camera Right here, I got it turned off right now, but it comes with like a little mic. It comes with, it's just like a small little vlogging camera. Hold on, I'm gonna turn it on for y'all. And boom, that's how it is. That's the little like screen, come with the screen. It come with this, it's just like a small little vlogging camera. Then I could, uh, what I said, I could like put it back like that. And then it's like touch screen and all type of different shit on there. Got all type of shit. I'm not like no camera expert, so I don't really know. I just saw when she was talking about it, she made it seem like it was like super easy to use. And that's all I need. I need something that's super easy to use, not too complex and not some shit that's doing the most. So um, yeah, that's what this journey looked like. It wasn't expensive as shit. So boom, I got me a vlogging camera now. I got me a YouTube camera. Uh, like I said, it came with like a little mic, the audio and shit. All that shit sounded cool on this joint. So y'all going to get to see uh, what it sound like, what it look like in my next video. Um, I'm super, it may not seem like it, but I'm super, super excited uh, to make new videos on an actual camera because I actually never done that. I've always been doing it on my phone. Um, maybe like my first ever YouTube video was on like a bullshit ass camera. You probably can go to like my very first video where I was like customizing shoes. It's still on my YouTube where I had like a bullshit ass camera. That shit was like $200, that shit was bullshit. But other than that, all my videos have been on my phone, which have been doing me good, doing me justice and shit like that. But like I said, I'm at a point where I wanna use a camera at this point, you know what I'm saying? So this is me elevating, trying to take my YouTube and just take shit to a whole nother level. So yeah, y'all gonna see what the footage look like in the next video and all that there. Um, I hope y'all excited for this journey. I hope y'all excited for all this shit because I'm super excited. Like I said, it might not seem like I am, but like I'm geeked up right now for real. Like geeked up to see how this shit gonna go. So yeah, I'm about to take my ass to sleep because I gotta wake up in the morning and fucking go to uh, the DMV. So and get my fucking new license plates and shit like that for the person who stole my shit. Whoever you are, if you watching my video and you stole my license plate, man, you weird. For real.